Tonight, the San Diego City Council is expected to vote on Mayor Gloria's proposed budget. It comes after city leaders restored funding to a number of programs. 10 News reporter Rachel Bianco is joining us live as dozens of people are weighing in on public comment. Rachel. Hi, Kimberly. Public comment just ended. Take a look inside council chambers. City leaders are going through that budget line by line. They say there were no easy decisions, but they believe this revised budget is one that will serve all San Diego. San Diego's growing homeless problem can be seen on just about every downtown sidewalk. City leaders say the revised budget prioritizes money for programs that help get people off the street and into housing. As the cost of housing continues to increase, these programs are critical to keeping San Diegans housed before they fall into homelessness and in providing services for our unhoused community. The revised $5.8 billion budget for the 2025 fiscal year sets aside 40 million for homeless services. That's 3 million more than when the mayor first unveiled the budget back in March. Our homelessness prevention program, which we call our housing instability prevention program, is a key, key piece in making sure that we do not have folks unnecessarily become homeless. The city says 260 families are enrolled in that program. The revised budget would allow more families to join. It also includes $9 million more for affordable housing. Homeless advocates say they're grateful for the additional money, but they say it's not enough. We still are looking for funding for the eviction prevention program. We would like to see more funding for uh, proper shelter uh, long-term housing and then also education around like tenant rights. The mayor says he was able to save money by suspending non-essential spending in city departments. Again, a vote is expected sometime this evening. The council must adopt a final budget by the end of this month. Reporting live outside council chambers, Rachel Bianco, ABC 10 News. An important meeting there tonight. Thank you, Rachel, for the update.